Good morning, you guys. Happy Tuesday. So I am sitting in the parking lot um, at work. I just got here and I just wanted to come on and open up the vlog. So uh, welcome, you guys. If this is your first time here, I'm so happy to have you. My name is Erica and this channel is all about uh, home decor and lifestyle so that if if that is your thing then um, please consider subscribing I would love to have you so um, y'all yes today is Tuesday but it is also my Friday because I am off tomorrow to start my Thanksgiving week holiday so I got things off to a great start this morning and picked up my Starbucks and this is the Grande Iced Praline Chestnut Latte. And I was watching Erica on It's E Lifestyle. I watch her channel a lot, um, and you guys probably do too. And in her latest uh, vlog, she was saying that um, she had went to Starbucks and had got the, I think it was the Iced Sugar Cookie Almond Milk Latte. And it was so funny, y'all, because she was like, this stuff is so nasty because <laughs> she saw somebody else get it and thought that she would try it and she she didn't like it. And she made a comment and she was like, if you don't get your drinks customized, then they're probably not going to be right. And she, she, she was correct in making that statement because what I found is that when I go to Starbucks, I do have to customize my drink or else it does not taste good at all. So I don't get the standard praline chestnut latte. So this one um, is made with oat milk. I get it with light ice. So it does not water down my drink. Um, I also uh, get it with no whip. I don't want any whip. And um, their drinks can sometimes be a little bitter. So I get two extra pumps of the chestnut praline sauce. So yeah, you do have to customize your drink at Starbucks or else they, it's it's not good. I, I totally agree with her. But I just thought that that was funny because I always thought the same thing. I was like, yeah, you have to know what to order and how to order it. That is key with going to Starbucks, especially with how much they charge. Um, and I also have the rewards app because as much as, as, much as you spend, yes, ma'am definitely get your uh rewards points so yeah that was my little starbucks bill but y'all i'm so excited because my daughter texted me this morning i woke up to her text and she said that her and the family were on the road getting ready to come down here so they are from um or rather she lives in georgia that's where i'm from and so her and her fiance and my grandbaby they are in route to get here so I called and checked on her um, this morning when I got in the car and she said that they were in Birmingham and they had stopped at Chick-fil-A to get some breakfast. So um, super excited for that. So it's about a 12 hour drive from Georgia to Texas and being on that they have baby girl and they're probably going to make more stops than, than usual. It'll probably take them about 13 13 and a half hours to get here so i'm estimating that they'll probably arrive around 9 9 30 at least that's my hope i think they'll get here um around that time and hopefully they don't run into a whole lot of construction you know um and the roads aren't super packed and you know they run into wrecks or what have you so i prayed for them this morning to have safe travels and i know that god is going to protect them and make sure that they get here safely so once they are here i will introduce you to my family i absolutely cannot wait so i'm gonna get in here um and get to work and get my day started i do have several things to do i worked from home yesterday and so i needed to come in the office uh, today so I could wrap up um, a few items that I need to get taken care of. But I hope that you guys are having a great day, a great evening whenever you are um, watching this. But yeah, so I will be back um, to check in with you guys uh, a bit later. All right, see you then. Hi guys, it is Saturday, November the 26th. And um, okay, hold on baby, I'm gonna introduce you, okay? 
So um, I hope that you guys had a great Thanksgiving. I am here with my granddaughter and my great niece and we just got dressed because we're about to head out um, for some brunch, um, all of us. So uh, she is anxious to meet you guys. So let me turn the camera around so that y'all can meet Miss Nyla. Okay, you guys, here are my two little princesses. Say hi, Nyla. Hi. Say hi, Nyla. This is Nyla with the gold shirt on. And that's Dakota. How old are you guys? Uh, um, I'm four. You're I'm, four? Uh -huh. Yes. How old are you, Dakota? Uh, I'm ten. You're four, too. Four. You're four. Both of y'all are four years old. What? Y'all, they I look so cute four. with their little outfits on. So, um, yeah, we Cody, are about to head out move. to brunch. Don't move, Cody. <laughs> And I will uh, check in with you guys here in just a bit. Hi everyone. So we just made it to Yardburg um, in downtown Dallas. Uh, we're just waiting on our food. The atmosphere, as you can kind of see in the background, is really nice and cozy here. But I wanted to introduce you to the rest of my family um, before our food comes. So let me turn you guys around. You guys, this is my handsome son-in-law, Gerard. <laughs> <laughs> That is my daughter, Brittany. Hi. And you guys already met little Miss Nyla. And then my mom is out to eat with us as well. You guys know her and my little niece, Dakota. So they just finished eating some fried green tomatoes. And we're just waiting on the rest of our the food to come out. Everything looks really nice in here. So we are about to eat and enjoy our meal. Y'all, so it is Sunday, December the 4th and I'm finally back on camera. It's been several days, y'all. Whew, it has been a little rough because um, as you guys uh, saw that my family, they were here for Thanksgiving and I hosted, plus they stayed here at my house um, for like four or five days. So it was a lot and um, work has been very, very very demanding and um i've just been really tired i haven't been really motivated to film or anything like that so i took all of yesterday um on saturday and just rested and relaxed and just did some self-care and just giving my body the replenishment um that it needed so i woke up this morning feeling pretty good and um i just wanted to let you guys know that Coming on here is not always easy. I'm not always um, motivated to want to pick up the camera and to film. And I'm going to be completely honest with y'all. So I came this close to being like, you know what? I don't think I want to create content anymore. I don't think that I want to just really pursue having a YouTube channel and being a content creator. And I woke up this morning to a comment from, I wanna say her name was Trina Trin. Hey girl, hey. And she was asking me about a product that I had used because she couldn't find it in um, my video. So I responded and I told her what the product was. And at the end of her comment, she was like, keep going. And I was like, wow. I like, I really needed to hear that. Um, as simple as that sounds, it really resonated with me because of the place and the state of mind that I currently was in. So um, as much as I come on here to encourage and support and, you know, have a positive attitude and to be uplifting and happy, like sometimes I need that, you know, that reinforcement or that, you know, that encouragement to be like, okay, you know what, keep going. We like what we're seeing. Um, so like that, that was everything. Like my, my subscribers are top tier, right? Like you guys are like my internet best friends and you know, we talk, we relate and um, yeah, so I am going to keep going. So I got up this morning and um, just did a little something to my hair. I don't, I'm not like dressed. I just put on some clothes. Like this is my favorite um, top. I even wear it when it's not, you know, the holiday season. So I just want to say thank you guys for just being here and just, you know, having those, you know, heart to heart conversations in the comments and just being so 
so kind and so supportive. So yes, I am going to keep going. Thank you for that. Um, but with that being said, um, so the family is gone. Work is still busy. I've kind of recalibrated and gotten back into my routine. But I did do some Black Friday shopping. Not a whole lot. I'm waiting on some candles to come. Um, and then I have a few things that I want to show you guys here that I purchased. So uh, New York and Company, they're like always having a really good sale. And um, I love wearing leggings. And so the only place that I get my leggings from are um, New York and Company because the quality is so good, but I will only buy them when they're on sale. So the leggings were on sale for $15 a piece. So I got my bag here, just taking them out the bag. I grabbed, I want to say six pair, maybe four to six pair. Yeah, so I got some uh navy blue leggings and for the longest jaw they did not have um the gray ones i don't know what was going on with production but they did not carry the gray leggings like forever so i picked up three pair of the gray leggings and then i got um a pair of black leggings here so that was all that i got from new york and company and so, like I am, you guys know that I that I love all the smell goods, like candles, I love body care. I'm really big on hygiene. And so, um, one of the things that I like to focus on is vaginal care, right? So, um, my cha-cha <laughs> is really sensitive, so I have to be careful with uh, the products that I use. But one thing that I swear by that I've been using like for years um, is this Yoni oil. And I uh, use it every time after I get out of the shower. So this is what it looks like. Um, I got it from Goddess Body. You can only order this online. And so um, I use this Yoni oil, like I said, faithfully. It is great. Um, and it gives me optimal vaginal health. And um, so, like I said, I use it every time after I get out of the shower. And let me see if I can find the ingredients for you guys. Um, da, 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 da. So it does have the ingredients on here. It's all natural botanicals that she uses. And it smells like lemongrass. This stuff is amazing. So it says on here that it restores balance, um, rids bacterial growth, maintain healthy flora, is antibacterial, antifungal, it's a toner and it is a natural lubricant. So like, you know, for the times where you're um, being intimate with your partner, you can use this also as a, a lubricant. But guys, this stuff is amazing. So she had like a 30% off sale. So I grabbed two bottles of that because I like to keep it, you know, keep it in my stash. So that was all that um, has been delivered so far for my Black Friday shopping. I did also purchase some candles. I participated in the uh, Bath and Body Works Candle Day. So I picked up some of my Holy Grails, nothing new, but some of the things that I've had before and then I wanted to just re-up because they um, had a really good sale. They were $9.95 for all of the three wick candles. So I did that. And um, also, so let's talk about some upcoming videos. So you guys, I am super excited because my um, home office furniture from Crate and Barrel will be delivered on Saturday, December the 17th. So I have that coming. So this weekend, while I was relaxing, I did do some online shopping and I went on ahead and purchased my um, desk chair. I bought that. I also bought my accent chair that I wanna have in my office. I ordered some curtains, the curtain rod, just some um, basic minimal office supplies. I got that. And let's see what else did I order. I think that's it. So things are going to be coming in slowly but surely from Amazon. And like I said, my office um, furniture will be delivered on December 17th. So I cannot wait to share that video with you guys. And um, also my home is Christmas ready. Um, I'm giving kind of like a little sneak peek back here. As you can see, I have my little ceramic Christmas tree right there. 
And then also right here, you can see I have my holiday pillow and I also have um, uh, my deer that you can see back there on my nightstand. So that video is also coming as well. I'm gonna go ahead and give my um, Christmas home tour. I'm gonna go ahead and shoot that video. And I also decided, I know I am late to the party, but I am going to go ahead and participate in Vlogmas. Um, I did participate in Vlogtober and I enjoyed that. It was a lot, but I enjoyed sharing that content and just taking you guys along with me. So there will be plenty of, I guess you could say like day in the life type of videos for Vlogmas. I am not going to upload every day. More than likely it will be um, every other day or every two days because I have to be realistic with, you know, the things that I have going on in my life right now. So I don't want to overpromise and overcommit and then, you know, just not be able to deliver. So I want to be realistic about, um, you know, my approach to Vlogmas. But yes, I do want to participate. So I will be bringing you guys some, some videos with that. So I'm super excited um, for the month of December. It is my absolute most favorite month um, or rather time of the year because it's the holidays. So I am going to go ahead and end this video here and get it uploaded today, which is Sunday because it's been like I think 14 or 15 days since my last video upload. So I need to get back into the algorithm and bring you guys some content because I do love sharing and interacting with all of you. So that is what's to come. Um, yeah, so I'm going to go ahead and close this video out. Thank you guys so much for being here and um, just being a part of the family. If you have not already subscribed, please do so. I would love to grow my YouTube uh, family here because there are so many more great things to come. Um, so you will see me in the same shirt because I'm going to go ahead and stop this video and start my next video. So um, hopefully I can get that uploaded. Maybe... Mm, I want to say probably Wednesday or Thursday is when that video will probably come out. So I will see you guys over there. Thank you so much for watching and take care.